the Lone Gable with West Palm Dogs, and to the moon with Maggie, and we're working on the watch and sit. So the watch is saying her name, and every time she looks up, I'm gonna say yes and treat. It looks like this, Maggie, yes. And what we're doing is building by the her face. We want to teach her that looking up is gonna report, is gonna, she's gonna get something she likes. Maggie, yes. Maggie, yes. I like your focus. Maggie, yes. Maggie, yes. And also we're teaching her that every time we say her name, she has to look up. I really like her focus, I like that even she's distracted, I say her name, she's gonna look at me. Maggie, yes. That's very good for her. If I, say, if I say her name and she doesn't look at me, what I'm gonna do is put that treat in front of her nose, beside my head, say yes and treat. Maggie, yes. And that's very good for Maggie. Now that's it. So most dogs figure out that sitting in front of someone gives them everything they want. But we want to have it in a verbal command. So I'm gonna throw a piece of food, Maggie gets it, now I'm gonna call her Maggie. Maggie sit, yes. Now I'm gonna treat multiple times to teach her that the face implied. To release her, tap on the head and the word okay. Very good, Maggie, ready? Good, she gets it. Maggie! Maggie sit, yes. I treat, treat again, tap on the head, the word okay, she's released. That, this is the last one I'm gonna do. Ready? Okay. Maggie gets it. Maggie! Maggie sit. Yes, treat. Treat again. One more time. Tap on the head, that we're okay, and Maggie's released. That's very good for Maggie. Nice job, Maggie.